<clears throat> that was the problem. You just don't do it on a building. Well, at least I figured it out. I guess that's my private garden. Well, at least the food problem is solved now. Okay, build feed food box one of one. Oh, I know why they want me to build another one. Because these two are not, they don't count that. Can I destroy these? Yes, I can. This means I can get the materials back. And my, my axe. I feel like my axe is about to break. Oh my goodness, I caught it. I need to fix that. Okay, come on. Oh. Of course that's gonna take forever because it needs to be repaired. I should do that. Hopefully I have the materials I need. Yes I do. Boom. Alright. Now that we have the materials. Our axe fixed. Yeah. I don't know if I'm destroying the war as well. Okay. Let's rebuild the war here. I think it was a window there, but I think I'm just gonna put a regular war. And that whoa. You saw that, right? Oh that tree just decided to spawn in while I was working. Okay, they're growing. Need more wood. It's like the game was saying, hey, you're gonna need more wood before you build another food station. I don't want to end up damaging my base. Oh. Build up. And start digging. Mining. You know, that's a that, that, that brings me a good point. When it comes to another update, maybe they can like uh, put it so you can dig, so you can like uh, fill in this area if you wanted to. So now that we have our okay, it's working now. Now we just need to place. This down. If I remember which button to press. Boom. And now it's harvest time. Oh, that little chicken is doing the harvesting. Nice. Okay. Food issue is solved. Okay. If I remember which button to press. Okay. Build a pal bed. Okay, so I need to build three of them. But I only have three. You gotta be kidding me. Meaning that it does not recognize those three beds as pal beds. This means this must be like some kind of glitch. The system doesn't recognize those beds as POW beds. I have three POW beds, but it's not recognizing them. 
And I can't destroy them. But I probably can. Yeah. Okay, I gotta grab my stuff that fell down here. Oh my goodness, I'm carrying way too much stuff. Can I, like, uh, fix? Maybe if I fix that, that will basically lighten some of the materials I'm carrying. Okay, come on. Okay. For some reason it won't let me place that there for some reason. Okay. Come back for that stuff later. I think I got all my stuff. Now I just have to take the long road back. So, time for a quick editing montage. We have some bushes going through our flanks. Finish. Okay, we're back, and I think that's the reason why it wouldn't let me place it down. Okay, now that we got that... Whoa, 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 whoa. That... Is that one of those shadow pals that only show up at night? What is that one doing here? In daylight? Okay, the game is definitely glitching out. Okay. Grab the base. All put together. So, let's try placing down three beds. See if the game recognizes it. Wait a minute. Could it not recognize the beds that are standing right here? Oh my goodness, don't tell me these beds, they don't recognize these beds as the how beds they have to be on the ground. Or maybe it's because they're floating over the ground and it doesn't count that. I have no clue. But let's deposit the items we need in our chest so we can actually move much quicker now. Stones the ones that the most. Seriously? There we go. So let's see. If it recognizes the beds now, because if it doesn't, then that means, yep, they need to be on flat ground. This means I just rebuilt those things for no damn reason. Might as well just take these out now. Geronimo! 
Well, let's head back up there. For cat help. I don't get it. Cat help. There's that. Okay. All right. Ah. Okay, that makes sense now. The reason it wasn't counting those beds because it was like basically floating in the middle of no nothing. So if the beds are floating like over this, it doesn't count. They have to be on solid ground. So, if I place the beds here, I shouldn't have a problem then, right? Let's see. Oh, one of them is being built by one of my pals. An invisible pal, apparently. Let's hope this works. Because this is technically on solid ground. Again! It does that again. Let's see. Button. Okay, so now it recognizes it. Okay. So we need to build a cat fire. Don't I already have a campfire? I guess it wants me to build another one, huh? And deploy a work pal to a base. Oh. That is easy. Okay, I can take care of that one. We'll do this one. And boom. Pal acquired to base. And I guess I'll build another campfire once I get enough wood as soon as a tree respawns. And it's kind of dark right now, so I can't see a blasted thing. But it's again with the screen going like I was freezing. What's the deal with that? I have no other clue. Okay, if you hear some noise, Back in the background, that's because the wind is blowing and we have a metal roof, and it's freaking annoying. Every time the wind blows, we hear like you know how some people would like literally rave a uh, like flat piece of metal to make like sound effects. That's what it sounds like. So it sounds more like a. Uh, Somebody is working on our roof. That's the best way to put it. They're not just walking, they're like running across it. That's the best way to put it. Of what it sounds like to us. Hopefully, with the settings, you don't hear it that much. But, I'm not... Oh. Yeah. Okay. Whoa, what the? Oh, wow. Okay. Let's close that. And I want to switch pals to that one being my partner. I just like this one because it's kind of cute. Okay, so we have to build a campfire. And I guess I'll build it right here. Not too close to it. Oh! She leveled up. Or he. Really can't tell. Oh my goodness, look at that! Build Pow. Great. Workbench. Winding workbench. Oh, I think I know what that is. Yeah, I think... Okay, I need some stones for that. 
Where would I know a place where I could get some stones quickly? Grab a few stones and wait until I run out of stamina. That's when I'll stop, and I should have enough then. Yeah, I probably have enough right now. And I'll put it right next to this barn. Let's place it so... I think it's supposed to be facing like this. But I think I'm going to have it like that. Can I put it inside here? No. Nope. That would be funny. Oh wow, three pals are going to try and build this. Oh, and one just decided to leave. Oh, my little pal. Friend. Okay. Oh. Okay, I think I need to assign a pal to it now. This way I don't get them confused. Let's see... Which pal should I have part of it? Maybe... This one? I would like to see this from the front, but the game... I can't assign that pal to that. I can't assign it to this. Does that count? No. That's not. But I'm pretty sure I made the right thing they wanted me to, right? Oh my goodness. I did not. Well, uh, chicken, need to move. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, damn it. Move. Move! Move, you stupid chicken, before I make fried chicken out of you. Seriously? I had no choice but to move it over here. Basically, this would be the workstation for the POWs. And honestly... There we go. So, does that count? Yes. Now I just need to build the stone power. And that's that Lucario clone. Now, I know that's Lucario lookalike. It's called Anubis. But at first, I didn't even know that was his name. Honestly. I didn't even bother reading up the name. I just assumed, because it looked like an Egyptian, I figured his name was Anubis. I am not joking. Okay, where's the Anubis statue? Here it is, and I have just enough. Wait. Oh, I can't place it underneath? So, if I place it here, I can't, like, build a ceiling, a wall, like, yeah, I can't build a roof above it. Okay, that's good to know for the future. My pals are amazing. My little buddies. Little amigos. Let's get back to our power station. Boom. Oh, look at that. One more upgrade. Let's see. Uh, stone pit. Logging site. Okay. So I have to build a...
So I have to build a place where the pals will like automatically mine for me. So give me the materials I need. So I need to figure out where I'm gonna place that. I know one thing for sure, I can place that on a platform. So put that there and we'll then grab the rock quarry. <coughs> Why do I need wood to make a rock quarry? There I'm gonna need a lot of wood. A lot of wood indeed. So let's start mining some wood. I should build a chest next to it. Hopefully the cows will automatically put the stones in there. <coughs> so grabbing all the wood I can, baby. My axe is damaged. Oh wait, I have a grind wheel. All the way over here. Hopefully I have the materials I need to repair it. I should, right? There we go. I probably have enough for it now. Hmm, not enough. I do want to make a chest first. So, how to place items in the chest? How to put the items in the base? And now I just need to on some more wood, I think? Or is it stone? Yeah, stone. Good thing the base is looking really good. Basically, I'm leveling up my character so that way I can get the more powerful pals. This base is looking pretty good. I definitely need to get started on that second part of the base. But right now, we're just trying to do these side missions. I honestly don't know how long I've been playing for so far. Okay, stop right now. Let's see, do I have... Come on. Choose that. Okay, so it should... Place it right there. And put them. I know for a fact that the pals will go on this. At least, I hope so. Looks like two pals are helping me. Now over there. It looks like that pal is helping me too, but from all the way over there? Okay. I remember one pal does all the mining for me. So, okay. And we need to build a logging site. But for now, let's take this pal. Take that in there. And bring back this pal. Of course, of course it would go way over to there because it's starving. Well, it just says it's hungry, but I'm pretty sure it's starving. Well, that power is definitely gathering materials for me. Hopefully...
I think. Oh, what's this doing over here? Wait a minute. Oh my goodness, they're storing more than just wool in here. Let's take this stuff and put it over here. So anyway, how I, you know, you know, uh, creators of power, here's something for the next update. Make it so you can assign materials to a certain chest. So that way your pals will like only transfer like the rocks and stuff over to the chest you put right next to it. And maybe it changes the color of the... Seriously! See? This, these stupid pals just transfer these stupid stones to wherever the chest is closest. I basically would have to organize this all myself. But anyway, I think I did enough for today. If you like this, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your friends. Until the next one, this is Edge, signing off.